All right, so today's video is going to be on Tourette's Syndrome. I was diagnosed back in kindergarten, so when I was five years old, had it ever since. I'm 19 years old right now. Um, <clears throat> so um, for this video, I'm gonna try to give some details. So most of these Tourette's uh, um, Syndrome videos are just of these cute little girls on, on YouTube doing their little twitches and stuff like that, and not really giving any information. So, I'm going to start off by saying that South Park, that South Park episode, most of us probably have seen it, blows it out of proportion. It's not just cussing and swearing. You've probably seen Tourette's guy. It's not just cussing and swearing. It, you can say stuff with Tourette's, but um, the thing with Tourette's guy, he's a drunk. Um, honestly, that's all he does. Like, if you see in every one of the dude's videos... All he does is drink beer and cuss a lot. I really doubt he has Tourette's Syndrome. Okay. <clears throat> so what is Tourette's Syndrome? Um, this is a reading off my laptop. A neurological disorder characterized by repetitive stereotype involuntary movements and vocalizations called tics. T-I-C-S, not T-I-C-K-S, like the little bug thingy. The disorder was named after Dr. George Gillies de la Tourette, um, who in 1885 first described the condition of an 86-year-old French noblewoman. Okay, so what are the symptoms? So they're usually short, repetitive tics. Um, so what I do with my Tourette's, I shake my hands a lot. I'll do that. I'll twitch my head like that. All right, great. Now I can't stop doing it. All right, give me a second. Um, I'll blink my eyes a lot. Um, um, you can do uh, facial stuff. Um, so let's see. Um, generally speaking, this does not go away. It can um, subside, I guess. It usually gets like to a point in adolescence where it's the worst. So uh, here's here's me at kindergartens and then when I reach my uh, teenage years it gets really worse bad and then what it can do is just stay like this or it can just go away but you'll still have it things that Tourette's syndrome prevents me from doing is joining the armed forces honestly if I didn't have Tourette's syndrome I would join the armed forces and make a lot of money and support our country. Um, I can't even join the Coast Guard because of it. So, <clears throat> I'm, as of right now, being 19, I'm, I'm stuck with these jobs that pay like $8 an hour for retail, McDonald's, fast food, stuff like that. Um, I'm stuck with those kind of jobs. Um, also, I, I try factory work, but eh, through temp agencies, that's not really a good idea. More on that later. Um... So, you can get medication for it. I'm on three pills a day for it. I take uh, clonidine. It was probably a more common one. Uh, clonidine. Respiridone is another one. Um, I'm also on Cymbalta. That helps with my obsessive compulsive disorder. Although it's um, an antidepressant, it's also used for obsessive compulsive disorder. Um... It's unknown what causes Tourette's syndrome. It just It's just one of those things that you develop. One in every thousand people are born with it. So in my high school, there's about 4,000 students. So there's a probability of four, maybe five students having it. I was one of them. Um, I did have another classmate who had it. His was a lot worse than mine, I could tell, like during a test, which is another thing that really makes your tics go off. Um, High stress environments, so you know when you're uh, working, uh, like a f uh, full time job at like I was doing 50 hours a week, and then I I was pretty twitchy, and then it like let's say you're in school, uh, college, high school, you're, you're taking a test, uh, that's when you can really notice your tics. Um, so that's those are the two main ones, and then general excitement, like let's say you're going to an amusement park and you want to ride. Um, a, a roller coaster that that could be another um, factor that ties into it 
So that's another thing for Tourette's is excitement, like nervous and stress. So let's see. So treatment, you know, you got to get some pills. Um, but it's, it can be inherited, but, um, I'm the only one in my family, both mom and dad's side, as of right now, who has Tourette's Syndrome. Um, I don't know where I got it from. It's just one of those freak things that you're born with. But, you know, uh, let me, let me tell you, uh, this is from looking at it sociologically from society. It's, people think it's weird that, you know, you're twitching, you're making these weird sounds out in public. Yeah, it sucks. I mean, back in elementary school, the you know, these kids don't understand what's going on with you. You don't either. So they're making fun of you because you you're like doing weird stuff in class. Um in middle school, they started to understand it. And in high school, that's when they really thought it was a cool thing and thought it was funny. Um let me tell you in high school, I got kicked out of class a couple times cuz I couldn't stop twitching. Um, I probably should not have cussed out the teacher either. <laughs> um, but that's, that's another thing. <clears throat> so, uh, what I really get pissed off about w with my Tourette's is people who try to say, dude, can you at least calm down or like go take a pill or something? It's like, well, I could try, but it's like, I can't control it. Um, cause people on Xbox... Um, some of my Xbox friends complained about it and I'm like, I can't help it. And, um, you know, if, if I could help it, I wouldn't be making these sounds, now would I? But honestly, I can't help it. Um, and then you have to, um, with twitching and stuff, you, you just do it to make yourself feel better. Uh, it's one of those things where you have to twitch in order to get that uh, good feeling and that self like fulfillment, I guess you could say. Um, I guess in severe cases, you can get like a thing drilled in your head and when they poke your brain and stop some sort of thing. But honestly, uh, mine's not that bad, but you know, I really only notice it when I'm working. Uh, right now I'm currently unemployed. Um, but you know, that's just, kind of things with Tourette's Syndrome. So, you know, it's not a bad thing you have it. Um, it's just, you know, you gotta educate others on it. And, you know, totally disregard Tourette's guy and South that South Park episode because those are not even what they're about. It, it really pisses me off how people in society will cuss and swear and say, oh, I have Tourette's Syndrome. I'm like, no, the fuck you don't. So, um, that's just my little information about Tourette's Syndrome, so comment, like, and subscribe.